Turn on casual to reduce damage taken by 30%, mad gain missed by other person, and but decrease item drop rate. Nah. Why would you play casual mode, dude? Casual mode is for pussies. If you wish to be your own person, to have your own ego, then don't give in to what others call normal. Okay. Hey, that's like me. I don't give in to what other calls normal. Only you can defend your will and desires, your beliefs and morals. <laughs> My morals are. Are really something. I'm just gonna say that. Because in this unjust world formed of incomplete thoughts, your ego is what makes you who you are. Agreed. Should the world deny your ego and refuse to accept it, then prove to the world that you live by your own rules. Neat. <clears throat> Are you awake? Then show me. Show me your ego. Okay. Neat. <clears throat> Get ready. Okay. So I guess I can only run around inside this circle. Camera. Oh, man, what's quick? It just makes me run faster. <laughs> Let me turn down the voice. Sorry, not voice, the music a little bit on my end. Okay. <clears throat> Should have used, uh, my gaming pad for this, but whatever, I guess. Mm, it's not map. Okay. Okay. No, uh, how do I get back? <laughs> okay, yeah. But how do I get back? Oh, G. Okay. Oh, hey there. Select action, arts, slash. Was I supposed to die there? <clears throat> the music is really good. Yeah, it's it's awesome. This is the, I just big. This is the beginning, the tutorial. I guess I was supposed Dead to die here. Disc. You died. Yes. <laughs> Dead. Another failure. What a shame. But the game is cheating. Okay. I feel like I'm so I was supposed to the die. World truly is a cruel and irrational place. It's like souls like, you know. In souls like you always die to your first boss. <coughs> this little one just isn't good enough. By the way, is the <coughs> Is the chat showing up on the screen? Or did I miss it? Yep, oh, okay. I think I just had the settings for... <laughs> C 
She's taking the same photo. Whoa! Ah! <coughs> uh. <coughs> they do. This dude looks cool. So I guess that was the intro to the game. Ah, our school somehow got trapped in a dimensional portal or something. Oh, original. I'm guessing this is gonna be a really cutscene heavy game. I think the game's mainly like kind of like a visual novel, I guess. <clears throat> Man, my voice is like cracking like hell. Oh, look, see, I didn't die. Yeah, everyone's dying. Well, Mr. New Student, your name, if you would. <laughs> mm, I see. How terribly charming. Oh shit. Oh shit, I forgot to <laughs> Oh damn it. I was just taking at the I was checking at the chat, I forgot to put one more ass. Ah oh, well, whatever. Welcome to Shin Mikado Academy. I am Yoru, otherwise known as your dean. Uh-huh. Now now. You can let your guard down. I just wanted to chat, is all. Especially with someone as extraordinary as you. I'm going to ask you a few questions. They'll pertain to your ego and the seven desires that make up your will. Do you mean seven to listen? The dean is so young. What does school life mean to you? Enjoying my youth. Well, you only live once. How about in class? Do you studiously take notes during lectures? I never take notes. Your teacher lauds the teacher's pet despite their bad grades. What do you think of this? Your teacher lauds the teacher's pet despite their bad grades? What? What? I don't know what... What, what does this mean? Oh, I think, oh, I think they're talking about, uh, what do you call them? <clears throat> uh, you know, those, uh, ass kissers, students, uh, good for them. It seems like your friend is about to mess something up. What do you do? Warn them to be careful, You're I guess. Standing in line for, hmm, let's say ramen. <laughs> ramen? Someone cuts in front of you, but you've been waiting for ages. What do you do? Uh, back of the line, bub. You need money to fulfill your goals, but you're flat broke. What do you do? I'm gonna give up. I'm, <laughs> I'm gonna. I give up like really fast. Have you ever looked at a naughty website on your phone <laughs> or your desktop, maybe? <laughs> uh, yes. I appreciate the honesty. Okay, let's say you're at a buffet. How do you decide <clears throat> what to eat? 
Uh, I guess I'll try different foods. A situation has already been settled, but someone insists on disagreeing. How do you respond? Uh, get annoyed. Someone you hate is loved by everyone around you. What do you think about that? And all of my business. You're forced to take on a leadership role. How do you make your decisions? Oh wait, I have a call. I'll be back. Wait. Okay, I'm back. Sorry for the delay. Um. <laughs> okay. Uh, you're forced to take a take on the leadership role. How do you take? Uh, I don't know what I do. Would you say you've ever truly loved someone? No. If you had extra that was time fun. and money, that was easy. how would you spend it? Uh, <clears throat> this one's kind of hard because I don't like to change that much. Like I'm like okay with whatever that happens. Personal growth. I wish this happens. Like I, I, I do this. Like uh, further my personal growth, but I'm, I'm just gonna do this one, I guess. What would you do if someone started spreading baseless rumors about you? Ah, <clears throat> uh, angry, really deny it. Someone or something you care for with every fiber of your being? There isn't. Choose one of these sets of words, would you? Reason, wisdom, resignation, I guess. Your desire for sloth surpasses all others. Uh -huh. Slow and steady wins the race, as they say. You're rational and quick-witted, and thus you're always looking for the easy way out. But when you run up against a challenging problem, you tend to give up and run away. So are you like... It's like a... What, was, what are they called again? Signs? You know, Capricorn, your Leo. Leos are like this. Capricorns are like this. Your desires are quite strong indeed. You have a firm sense of self and a stable ego. Something about you seems unbalanced though. Man, I feel like I'm reading a newspaper, you know, the part where they like talk about your signs, like Capricorn does this, if you are a Capricorn you do this, 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 if you are a Libra you do this, this and this. None of your desires should be neglected, you know. <laughs> Without desires, your ego can't grow. Without an ego, you're no different from a doll. So be frank with what you want as you attend this academy, and live how you see fit. Okay. Thank you. I understand you so terribly well now. I never get to chat with others this much. It's nice. Life at the Academy may be tough, but I know you'll be able to adapt to it right away. Let's speak again if our paths cross. And remember, I'm expecting great things from you. Oh, that ass kind of bothered me. Why didn't it, like, Tell me that, hey, are you sure that's your name? Wake up. Well, I guess you wouldn't, like... Please, open your eyes. <clears throat> you know, get your name wrong. He seems alright. Yeah. Uh, okay. Thank goodness. You okay? Can you stand? The mist is too thick. Let's move.
<laughs> oh. Can I... Can I rotate? Where are you going? We have to follow them. Can I rotate? Oh, okay. With. Okay, then. I really should have picked the gamepad for this. Okay, what Where if I? You oh, you wouldn't let me go there. We have to yes. Them. Okay. What if I don't follow them? You know. Zero percent mad. <clears throat> Stop. Hold up. What's your name, by the way? I'm beat. I think I'm actually dying. Can't go on. Dude, you just walked like 10 steps. Oh, wow, how are you so out of breath already? You're out of breath already? We barely yeah. moved. That's you exactly... Should exercise <laughs> more often, Dr. Kakeru. That's exactly what I said. Who's got the time? I'm a weak old man. You trying to kill me? Uh, with Nozama, was it? It's Nozome Hinata. You work here. The least you can do is remember the students' names. Hey, I'm a doctor, not a teacher. Besides, I'm more used to calling you Prez anyway. Ah, student council mm -hmm. president. More powerful than world government. <laughs> so much has happened. I couldn't find you for a week. You have no idea how worried I was. But... Who are you, miss? I'm so glad you're okay, though. When we heard a student collapsed on the second floor, I never imagined it'd be your brother, Chio. <laughs> the second year building is connected to this one. Maybe he came from over there. Hey, are you okay? You're not hurt, are you? Who are you? That's not very <laughs> funny. This is no time to be joking, you know. Wait, you really can't remember? Huh? What's your name? You remember that much at least, right? Uh. uh I can't believe I missed an S. Wait, Chio, I thought your last name was Aikawa. Oh. <clears throat> Wait. What if I... Okay, what would have happened if I named the last name of my name as Ayakawa? Would the dialogue change? Um, well... Hmm. Our family isn't exactly a traditional one. Ah, I see. Can you remember anything besides your name? Family, friends, <laughs> anything about the school? Any? I don't remember a thing, I don't remember a thing, I don't remember a thing. No. <laughs> I'll bet whatever made him collapse is also the cause of his amnesia. Well, the mist does tend to drive people crazy. We don't know much about it. It's bad for people with weak respiratory systems, though. Like Chico here. My name is Chio. But despite all that, your little sis came all the way here to see you. She wouldn't take no for an answer. Mm -hmm. You understand what I mean? <clears throat> no. <laughs> Not really. Man, you forget your manners too? You're the last person I want to hear chastising people over their manners, Dr. Kakeru. The least you could do is thank her. <laughs> thank you, Chio. Don't worry about it. 
I'm just glad you're okay. <laughs> Welcome back. Well, we've had our little breather. Let's move. We should hurry on out of here. There's no mist on the first floor. <clears throat> It'll be safer there. Okay, let's go. But what is that? What did the Why did the mad meter go up? Oh, is it like is it because of the fog? Why are you saying wait? What? What's that sound? My head hurts. Everyone, stay close. Run to where? Mind? Not a chance. I'm staying right here with you. We can't run anywhere. Don't we are like stupid. You're just gonna get us all killed. There's no place to run. I don't care. I'm not going to let you sacrifice yourself. Shit. Watch out! Who are you? Tremble in delight. I am the abyss. I am one and I am all. The world and the self, ephemeral, eternal. And so too do I hold your destiny. my interlude I asked you a question <sighs> hurtful heathen deranged devil sadistic sadist you may refer to me 
as Vanitas. Vanitas. Let me lend me your power. Tell me how to beat them. Prove your power to your pursuers. These dastardly dissidents are demons. Lackeys of their lowest level. Legions. But even the lowliest legion would leave a lack-witted lug like you lifeless. I, however, possess a plethora of power. Prostrate before me and pray I spare you. Show me the delightful sight of your struggle to survive this plight, and I just might. Hey! Have you heard even one single word I've said? Go at them unarmed and you're as good as dead. You are utterly deranged. Can't you just let me give you my cryptic mystical spiel? A facade with no memories within expectation, but no manners or sense of self-preservation? Gah! Enough! Dealing with you is giving me a headache. I cannot lend you strength, but I can still assist. After all, fate is static. It'll always persist. Whoa. Okay. What the? Okay. Bam. Whoa. <coughs> This looks cool. That is an magic ear. Your soul made manifest. You'll need it in the other world to make it through the rest. yours for the taking a reflection of your ego a fiend of your making the fiend of slot has joined you does this have anything to do with the choices i made because <clears throat> are you telling me that i'm a slot because of the choices i made or something like that Or slot is supposed to come anyhow. Because I do see myself as a slot. Using a different rule in the current uh, unit turn and allow a unit that has already acted again, but it's causing. Okay. No, no, let me read it again. Using a defer will end the current unit's turn and allow a unit that has already acted to act again, but at the cost of increasing the unit that means mad ga gag. Uh, <clears throat> use it as needed to gain the upper hand in battle for example 
having a powerful unit act multiple times in a row. You are victorious if you fulfill the stages victory condition. You are against the schedule, however, the game will end. Resulting in a game over. Okay. Get ready. This much. Uh, can't do anything, okay. No mercy. I want it. You want what? Here I go. Share authority serious enemy serious with the one of the ally large speed now. percent one hundred percent Your calls, your cheering cries. Return to your world now. Go claim your prize. Hold it right there. <laughs> I don't take orders from you. With that, farewell and adieu. Bring your ego and power to bear against the irrational and unfair. I'm gonna take about the screenshot, so...
Monarch. Act one. Nozomi Hinata. Blind old savior. This is... the Academy? We made it back! Is everyone all right? <sighs> Perfectly fine. Just a little bruised. <laughs> what do you look so worried about? It's all saying that, um... You've been unconscious ever since you answered that weird phone call. I'll take Chio to the infirmary. You two go on down for now, okay? But, but why did she pass out though? Alright, let's get going then. We can talk about the other world later on. Sure, blindfold savior. Who's the blind fool? And what were you doing on the second floor, former student council president Hinata? Former. Hello, Karama. We are fighting demons. I thought I declared any areas overrun with mist off limits. I await your explanation. <clears throat> who's who's this guy? You there. Do not interrupt me. Or do you truly have no idea who I am? I truly don't know. Allow me to debrief you. After the mist, barrier, and other anomalies appeared, the last student council tried to dispel the chaos with the faculty. And yet, said chaos has only increased. It was then that a savior appeared to quell the unrest, rallying the students with his overwhelming charisma. Oh, you're the blindfold savior. That savior is none other than I. Yeah, sure. President Kurama Hitotsubashi. Whoa, what? What? Why are there eyes duties, red? And at the behest of all, I took on the mantle of student council president. Are you sure you're not just giving them so weed or what something? what say you, Hinata? How does it feel to see how much more capable I am in comparison? It's true. I was inadequate for the demands of the office. I commend you on acknowledging your inferiority. Now, why did you enter the mist? Well... He collapsed within the mist, so you ventured in to save him. And this was with Dr. Kakeru Hasegawa and Chio Aikawa? Yes. I see. 
So you placed both the Academy's doctor and a middle school student in peril. Your foolishness <laughs> astounds me. You should have come to me. As your student council president, I would have rescued him in a safer manner. How so? <laughs> you may no longer hold the position yourself, but you still set a poor example by behaving this way. I believe some discipline is in order. What say the rest of you? Agreed! <laughs> Pardon the interruption. Oh, well, hello, Dean. But would you mind if I borrowed this young man and Miss Hinata? We have urgent matters to discuss. Well, well. If it isn't Ms. Sora Jingu, our beloved Dean. <laughs> <laughs> I'm laughing because uh I'm laughing because uh how in the anime student council president is like has more power than the world government <laughs> like doesn't care about deans or anything he's like the ruler of the like whole world or something Yes, that is my name. Is something the matter? You! Did I not warn you about interrupting me? No, you didn't. Dean Jingu, we must consider impeaching Hinata for violating Academy regulations. Impeaching? Of course, it truly breaks my heart to punish one of my peers, but order must be maintained in our academy. Hmm. No further action will be required at this time, Mr. Hitotsubashi. Thanks to you, of course. And not just from me. The rest of the faculty and student body are all very grateful to you. I'd hate to see you suffer from the guilt of punishing your peers, even if it was done out of responsibility. Surely it'd be fine to let it go this once. <laughs> As you wish, I'll leave it at that. I, I kind of wish the animation was grief more after faster. All. Come along, everyone. To the student council room. Yes, sir. Remember, Hinata, there won't be a next time. Well, that takes care of the rank and file. Why don't we have a chat in that empty classroom? I see. So you were dragged into the other world after answering a phone call in the mist. Yes, quite normal stuff. Hmm. You know, the usual. There's just one thing I need to know. How exactly did you... How did they flee the other world and make it back to here? Is that the question you seek to ask, oh woeful overseer? Vanitas? A demon? No. A monarch? Whoa. How did you get into this academy? So Dean knows I more about this stuff. for which you strive. Vanitas, the being who helped them survive. Oh, look at his tongue. A demon? Helping? Hm. So that's how it is. Did you make a pact with a demon in exchange for power? An authority, so to speak. Did I? <clears throat> I 
I did gain an authority. And what did you wish for? I didn't wish for anything. I'm gonna be honest, if I was to wish for something between these two, I will pick the power to survive. Beset by the legions with nothing to give, no wonder he asked for the power to live. So you weren't actively seeking to become a pact bearer. I sense that someone managed to return from being drawn into the other worlds, but this, I never imagined. To think a new pact bearer would emerge as a result. Okay, so what's if going on? Ask, what sort of authority did you receive? I got the one where I can share my the stats. authority of vanity. I've never heard of that. Perhaps it's an aberration of some sort. You're surprisingly knowledgeable about all this demon and otherworld stuff, Miss Sora. That I am. But extenuating circumstances prevented me from talking about them before. These secrets are normally reserved for the head of the Jingu family, as is the position of Academy Dean. Doesn't this mean However, <coughs> you are kind of responsible you for know, what happened no to the school? Any further. I'll answer any questions you have. Because you're the only one who's like linked to all of this stuff. Where's the other world? There is a metaphysical plane that exists separately from the physical world, ascertainable only via cognition alone. That is the realm you visited, the other world. Uh huh, okay. What are these demons? Demons are supernatural beings that live in the other world. They feed off the egos of humans. What do you mean by pact? There are seven demons known as monarchs, one for each sin. As progenitors of lesser demons, they are of the highest order. If they make a pact with someone, they are then able to provide their pact bearer with an authority. In order to make a pact, one must have a cause, a strong ego, the ability to perceive the other world, and a wish. But vanity is an aberration. It isn't one of the deadly sins. Your pact with that monarch was incidental at best. Mm -hmm. Consider a far-fetched goal. Curing an incurable illness, for example. Reality can't be changed no matter how hard you wish. But if someone learned that the power to overturn reality existed, would they be able to resist temptation? Even if such power came from demons and gave rise to widespread distortions. Distortions? Powers from the other world are against the natural order. Continued usage of them will cause our world to distort. The mist, the barrier around the academy, the calls from the other world, all are byproducts of a pact bearer's authority. So please, unless the situation demands it, I ask that you avoid using your authority on campus. The Jingu okay. family has maintained balance in the world ever since the academy's founder discovered the existence of demons. We've attempted to prevent the emergence of new pact bearers at any cost. And yet they've appeared regardless. Yeah, right we at are the currently academy. Aware of at least seven others. Voiding their pacts is the only way to put a stop to these anomalies and restore normality. Might I ask you to use your powers for the welfare of our academy? I believe a pact bearer of your circumstances would be perfect for this task. Please, bear with me. Your compliance would be appreciated. I refuse. <coughs> so using this power are what's gotten us into this mess, but you're telling me to use this power anyhow?
Okay, but <clears throat> why are you telling me to do that? Aren't Jingo family the protectors of whatever reality or whatever this is? Shouldn't you be more capable of stopping this than me? Like, my powers are what's like causing all this, right? You know, being a bag bearer and whatnot. Yeah, I'll do it anyhow. Okay. You have my thanks. <laughs> now then, would you prefer a detailed explanation on how to void the packs, or will the gist of things suffice? Eh, uh, just give me a gist. While exploring the mist in the academy, you will receive calls that connect you to the other world. There, you will find crystals known as ideals. Shatter them, and it will render the Pact Bearers powerless. Though it pains me to ask this of a student, the fate of our academy is in your hands. Why well, I mean particularly, <laughs> though? Good luck. Mr. Vinitas, I would appreciate if you concealed yourself around any students who are unaware of the situation. Your appearance would cause a great deal of panic, to put things lightly. I'm here for the boy, so don't worry your head. My only concern is what road he will tread. I'll take that to mean you intend to behave. These are reference materials about demons, packed bears, and the other world. Give them a read when you get the chance. Ready to start packs, the other world demons. Blah blah blah. I'll be taking my leave now. Goodbye. Okay. <clears throat> oh wait, I'm covering up the... It's like a uh, map, mini map. My camera is covering that up, but whatever I guess. It's not, it's not something that's important. You do the list, smile, do the list, story progress, location, corner of the house. Library, yes, shooting materials, collect to the game, achievements, some things, okay. Yeah, I'm never reading those. So I guess that's it for today. I'm gonna bail. Goodbye. Let me just um save. How did I get the phone again? R. <clears throat> okay, uh Goodbye, guys. <laughs>